think we lost them. Lost them? But she's never even have found them. Yeah, and whose fault was that? Yours! I, you said the plan was foolproof? Yes, if I followed it to the letter, not if it went completely off the books. Well, you insisted I brought bloody baklava. Balaclava, you idiot. Balaclava, we went over that at least ten times. Well, at least I tried. I, I thought you just wanted a pre iced snack. Maybe I had to find a shop that sold it and everything. At least say you got some good shit. Some good shit? What the fuck is that? What, the bear? No, the stain on your trousers. It's not the fucking bear! What are you doing with a bear? It was in the corner of the shop. Is that what you were doing back there? You said the shop had an extra safe. I thought it did. And did it? No. <sighs> More lost money aside, what are you doing with a fucking stuffed bear? It's a Barry bear. Rosa's wanting one for ages, the birthday's coming up. You know this. Yes, hence the reason we're doing this. Rent, food, your daughter's birthday. Did you not think you could maybe steal the money and then buy her the bear she actually wanted? I didn't think of that. Evidently not. So, now what? Did you steal anything of value? Literally anything? Give me something to go home with. I'm not a complete idiot. I did steal some money. You know how the other day you were saying you saved fivers? Oh, for fuck's sake. Boom. Hi. <laughs> You've really set a new bar here, haven't you? Not only have you stole fivers and now tells, you stole three. There's only three in the till. And this is without even mentioning your van. Right, the clutch being fucked is not my fault. It is your job to MOT your van. Yes, but in order to MOT my van, I need money, which I don't have, which is why we do this. It's a vicious cycle. No, dealing with you is a vicious cycle. Fuck this, I'm done. I tried my best. 